Welcome to Pooh Corner. Mr. Cheesy Pop. Hey everyone, it's Max. I'm here at Pooh Corner. The actual Pooh Corner. The 100 acre wood is right here. So this is where we are on a map. Ashdown Forest is the actual forest. And here's Pooh Corner where uh, Christopher Robin bought all the sweets. So let's go in. Just poo everywhere. Yeah, as you might imagine, at Pooh Corner. Every kind of poo you could ever want at Pooh Corner. So cool. Look at all that. Uh, why don't you introduce yourself for everybody? Um, hi there, I'm Neil, and um, this is my home, essentially. Uh, we are um, the owners, me and my wife, of Coo Corner in Hartfield, which is just a... A few a few minutes mm -hmm. walk away from the world famous Pooh Bridge and the spots where all the books were written cool. originally. Yeah, we're about to go do and, that. Um, oh, brilliant! Oh, yeah. you'll love it. It's really yeah. good. And um, we uh, are in right now the bakery that uh, A. A. Milne would have come in with E. H. Shepherd and various mm -hmm. bits of pieces. And the other side of the building is the sweet shop that Christopher Robin would have come into, <laughs> and he would have bought his sweets. And he always bought the same sweets and he used to come up the hill and down the hill with Jessica, his donkey that he used to ride on the back oh my of gosh, and um, and this is this is where it was real this is where it all really happened and and then something magical happened and the world bought into it yeah, but sure. today the reason that uh, obviously we've just been talking yeah and um, one of the things that sorry I'm doing all the talking aren't I? no it's fine it, can, can I do your job yeah, yeah I, I, mean, I really like this this, this is really a fun cool. job right yeah, no, I want it. I want it's, it. a good, it's a good thing yeah. the, the main thing about it is is what we're doing at the moment this is a, a bit of a sneak peek mm -hmm. is um this yeah um which is a poozium so a poozium oh, i love there. this i love this genius yeah, yeah. that wasn't my idea. brilliant yeah. so yeah so what we're doing at the moment and ignore the mess we've got lots of stuff coming in these two little creatures here what you're looking at is a uh winnie the pooh and a piglet made by a lady called agnes brush and she actually made them in the 40s. Oh, wow. So uh, they were made in Long Island, New York. That's where I'm from originally. Well, there you go. So that's, Whoa. Whoa, there you go. That's amazing, amazing. isn't it? So, so okay. that is probably um, some, there's many collections and there's, she did some wow. amazing, but this is the first ones we've been able to get a hold of. That's really and cool. they're probably some of the first in the UK. <laughs> Who doesn't want some 90s Winnie the Pooh Happy Meals? Probably had that. <laughs> exactly. Uh, we're doing a little display on Japanese stuff and we oh, love cool. these key rings, the little, little, um, really there. So if you see the little chappie on the right, that is Winnie Pooh. That's Winnie Pooh? That's Winnie Pooh. That is the Russian Winnie the Pooh. That's Russian Winnie the Pooh. Yeah. Is I that... don't know whether Disney would agree with that. I don't know. But that yeah. is Russian Winnie the Pooh. I never knew. So there you go. Second new. There's a, a couple of videos of that on YouTube that are actually very, very good. Here's a 1950s Parker Brothers game. So pre-Disney. A great Sears shape fitter truck that as you pull mm -hmm. along the characters wobble. Of course. <laughs> of course. Who doesn't, who doesn't right. uh, you know, one of, one of England's best exports apart from <laughs> Winnie the Pooh. Christopher Milne's own unedited uh, proof copy of his book Path Through the Trees. And here's a copy which he has signed. Whoa. So that was uh, done for, uh, he had a little bookshop in Dartmouth. Here is Punch Magazine from 1924. Punch Magazine? So Punch Magazine is actually the first place where Winnie the Pooh ever appeared. Oh. And he appeared in Punch Magazine as the bear before he was Winnie the Pooh. So that is an original print of the first time that Winnie the Pooh appeared that was a collaboration between E.H. Shepard and A.A. Milne. Wow. And you'll notice that it's uh, called Teddy Bear because they didn't know that he was going to be Winnie the Pooh. Right. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. The actual writings mm -hmm. of A.A. Milne. So that is how he wrote the book. And then that's obviously how it appeared on the page. I love this. A little bit of the original Pooh Bridge. So when, they, mm. when, when it was rebuilt by a group of locals with the help of Disney, mm -hmm. um, they took some of the original bridge and they just made some little kind of napkin rings and other bits out of it and and this is one of the bits so you know there's an original bit that that uh you know just little bits of history but we've got some amazing Ooh. bits coming in here and it'll become a, a hopefully a, a a fitting tribute to um uh uh to the world of winnie the pooh and a a milne and e h shepherd and christopher robin or christopher milne you basically saved this whole place right because it was well, it, 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 it nearly um, shut down, yeah. and our job now is to protect it and make sure that it's it's here for the future. Well, that's um, really wonderful. Thank you. Well, so when 
When do you plan to have like the museum part of, of Pooh Corner open? The museum or the Poozium? Uh, the Poozium, yeah. sorry. Poozium, let's get that sorry, right. Come on. Um, we've, uh, we're hoping that that'll be open around, worst case, by the so end of July 2019. We're, okay. we're there. So, Amazing. Yeah. Yeah, so you gotta, you got a sneak preview. Yeah. Don't good. tell anyone. Yeah. yeah. No, tell everyone. <laughs> Please come to Pooh Corner. Right. Thanks. It's that's fun. awesome. Yeah. That's the bakery, and then that's. So that would have been the uh, the sweet shop and the, the tobacconist or the, the cigarette shop Aww. that uh, Chris Robin would go in and, and uh, he'd park Jessica, his donkey, up here <laughs> and then walk in. They also have a tea garden back here, guys, so you can uh, you can actually have a bit of tea. Now let's go see the forest. So now we get back in the car and uh, we're going to head to see some poo sites. So we've just entered the poo car park. So we parked at the poo parking area, right? And now we're here. Just uh, walked over here to the right and we got, <laughs> we got this. It's more. Oh, this is great. Another one down there. So in case I didn't tell you guys, right, this forest was the inspiration for A.A. Milne because he lived right around here. So you come here, get that inspiration, <laughs> make some magic happen. And uh, yeah, so we're just walking down this uh, this path here. Getting to the poo bridge, hopefully. So we've been walking for just a few minutes and now it says bridge straight ahead. Looks like we've come upon Owl's house right here. Oh, there it is. You really have to look carefully when you're in the forest because you can spot things like this. Ooh. Here it is, guys. Oh my gosh. See that bridge back there? <laughs> not the one. Keep going. So you can come to your first bridge. It's not Pooh Bridge. But there's a little sign that says P Bridge straight ahead. There's these signs right here, bridge, so you just keep following. Alright guys, you just have to avoid the poo <laughs> to get to the poo bridge. <laughs> hey, yay! Welcome to Poo Bridge. Aww. Oh look, they even give you use poo sticks brought with you or picked up from the ground. Yep, so they encourage you to do it, just don't damage any trees, obviously. This is great. Yay, we're on the Pooh Bridge. Isn't this awesome? Yeah. This is really great. I, I'm, I'm loving this. And we got our poo sticks. So we, we will we will we will play and see who's wins. Yours is very tiny. It's <laughs> good. Uh, we're gonna drop it in and we'll see who who wins. Because yeah, okay. we think it should go that way. Alright, let's let's okay. let's try this. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three, go! Um, oh. oh, I'm winning. Oh, you have got length though. Yeah, I do. <laughs> okay, I am. Oh. Oh. All right, let's, let's see. Let's see who comes out the other side. <laughs> if they're actually still going. Oh, I see mine. Do you? <laughs> yeah, I actually do. I don't know if you can see it on camera. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I do see it. <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> I've got Oh, stuff. there's yours. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, they're actually gonna come out. They are gonna come out over here somewhere. So, <gasps> let's just see. Oh, there it is. It was. Uh, I. Who won? I mean, I think I'm quite further ahead. Uh, whatever. <laughs> this race doesn't end until. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think you're winning. Uh, I think. I think. I think. I think you just got that good current. I should have. I should have made the stick shorter. <sighs> It's very sad. Whoa, now it's really going. I'm racing ahead now. Yeah. <gasps> I've really slowed down. But are you going to get caught in that? Yeah. Yep. Oh. Boom. 
Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> okay, we joined the, uh, the group over there. That's lovely. Who threw that in? Maybe we need the poos actually here. Congratulations, Emily, you've won poo sticks. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. Um, it's an honor to yeah. have played with you. I'll get you some honey. Thank you. Okay. We'll steal it from Piglet. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> no, man, you're gonna steal <laughs> no. Piglet's honey. No, no, I'm joking. So there's the bridge from the other side. The whole poo bridge. I love this. Back in the car now, we're gonna go see the enchanted place that's at Piglet Parking. Yay! Piglet's Parking. All right, so now we're in the Piglet Parking area. We're gonna just head on uh, this trail. We just emerged from there. <laughs> you can see Ashdown Forest. I mean, this is all around us. You know, the 100 acre wood is actually a 500 acre wood. <laughs> Uh, so, <laughs> it's, it's, it's quite big as you can see. Seems like there's a little, just lookout point up here that will give us, oh yeah, just a beautiful view of, wow. Oh yeah, here we go. Hmm. Is that not gorgeous behind me here? Hmm. Well guys, there is a look at the actual 100 acre wood, Pooh Corner, Pooh Bridge. I, what, 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 a, what an amazing experience. Something I probably never thought I would actually do. Like, you think you'd ever play Poo Sticks at the actual Pooh Bridge? <laughs> what? Really cool. And, and it's a free activity to do. I would say give yourself about, you know, a couple hours. Especially when the Pooh Museum and all that, the Poozeum goes in and everything over there. So you could combine that and then your trip to these these two locations. Uh, the walk to the Pooh Bridge and back took about yeah, 40 minutes or so. Spent some time there. Uh, you could keep walking far, as you know. 500 acres, that's a lot of walking you could do. But it's so beautiful and I, 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 just, I just loved it. Loved it. Loved it! Uh, you guys ever done this before? Let me know in the comments below. Like, subscribe, check out my Patreon page. And... Go check out Pooh Corner when you come up here, okay? Cool. Have a magical day, everybody. Bye.